Hey, what is going on guys? I am the Explosive Gamer and welcome to my first of very many Call of Duty Advanced Warfare news videos. So, starting off it with it now, we have our pre-order special bonuses packages thingies. So, uh, in these there's an $80, $100, and $120 uh, edition. So there's the uh, standard edition with the $60, so it con just comes with the game and, uh, and the Advanced Arsenal which comes with everything. So every time, when, no matter what, when you pre-order Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, you get the Advanced Arsenal package. Um, so that'll be in any for any within everything that I mentioned. But with the eighty dollar, um, that just comes with uh, whatever I'll speak of right after this. So there's an eighty dollar, hundred, hundred and one hundred twenty. I'll speak more in depth about each edition when I talk in the future. But over the next coming weeks and month, I guess, until Call of Duty Advanced Warfare is out, I'll be doing news videos. Uh, because the multiplayer reveal is out on the 11th of August, and I am actually, oddly, excited <laughs> to see this. Because I uh, have been let down by everything else. Like, uh, Ghosts, I did the exact same thing for, and I was actually a lot hyped. A lot more hyped for that than I am right now. But still, it was hyped up because I did like Black Ops 2. It was kind of screwed, but I liked Black Ops 2. And MW3 I liked, but it was still dis dis uh, it was still a disappointment. Uh, but Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, I, I have higher hopes for, but also lower hopes for. One, because it's a new developer, Sledgehammer Games. Um, that's why I have higher hopes, is because it's a new developer, but also, also uh, not hoping way too high because it's a new developer. So, anyway. So, in all of these... Additions, they'll come with two new guns the BAL 27 as assault rifle AE and the Atlas 45 pits pistol it also comes with the Atlas exoskeleton so it's pretty much a camo that's the the same kind of camo is on the uh, two guns too and also there's also a Atlas helmet that comes with the exoskeleton and there's also an Atlas player card that has the same color scheme to it there's also the bonus map gorge a remake of Pipeline from Call of Duty 4. This is the oldest remake I think we've had. Um, yeah, I think this is the oldest remake of a map that we've had in any Call of Duty so far. So that's pretty cool. Um, the In these, they also come with five supply drops. Um, I'm assuming these supply drops are... Uh, well, the supply drops uh, come with... Bon uh, extra weapons, uh, uh, well it helps, it gives you weapon unlocks, camo unlocks, and I think attachment unlocks, I don't think about, uh, that attachment thing I'm not sure about, but the weapons and camos I am sure for. Um, there's five of those, and what I've heard, from what I've heard, I think what's going to happen every time you level up, instead of getting unlocked tokens like you did in Go in uh, Black Ops 2, or you get, until it, or if, instead of getting uh, points or whatever like you did in um, Ghosts, I think what you're gonna do, you're gonna get each one of these and you're gonna randomly unlock weapons instead of choosing what you unlock or up unlocking in, or in sequence. So you can unlock, unlock any random weapon every level you time, every time you level up or every five levels. I don't know exactly. But uh, so every time you level up, you'll unlock a perk, uh, exo ability, tactical, uh, tactical lethal grenade, uh, both uh, uh, weapon, uh, pistol, or, or pro secondary or primary weapon. Um, so, like I said, exo abilities already. Uh, kill streaks, you'll unlock that and everything. It's kind of like what happened in MW3, except because you know how you, uh, or any Call of Duty before that, you unlocked everything in sequence. But instead of unlocking in sequence, you unlock randomly that just dots across the board and it just randomly happens. Um, and you don't have to get a certain amount of points to get it either. So I think in, I'm thinking it's going to be a combination of the two minus the points. I'm hoping that's what it is because that'd just be a lot easier and cooler. And you also get the single player exo upgrade token. So in single player, you use tokens to upgrade your exo suit so you can use different abilities. And you're also getting the advanced arsenal, like I mentioned. Now, in the $80 edition, it comes with everything I just said and the ass. Atlas Advanced Soldier Manual that, that has a sound that has soundtracks and, and an art book that comes with it. They also there also has a steel steel book game case that the game comes in a steel book like you did in any previous Prestige Edition or Hard Edition that you get of the game for. Now moving on to the hundred dollar one, you get the season pass but no steel book. So you get everything I just mentioned except for the no steel book and no 
uh, manual art book thing. So everything I mentioned from before, aside from the $80 thing, plus the season pass, but no steel book. Uh, in the $120 edition, there's everything. Everything I mentioned comes in the $120 edition. I'm, I want to be getting the $120 one. I don't know if I'll have the money, but I'm hoping I can because that has everything. I want everything. I want it as much as I can get. So that'd be really cool. Uh, anyway, guys, um, tell me what you were, which Call of Duty Advanced War Warfare pre-order special edition if that you're getting if you're just getting the $60 one uh, with nothing just the Atlas advanced at arsenal or do you want the $80 $120 or $80 $100 or $120 one so the $80 one doesn't come with the doesn't come with the season pass I want the season pass personally but the art book would be cool and I kind and I love having the steel books man for ghosts I didn't even really like the game but the steel book was cool so that's what I'm gonna get Anyway guys, hope you all enjoyed and if you like and share the videos of the channel out. Don't forget to leave or tell me if you're even getting if you're getting advanced or which one of these editions are you getting? Or are you just getting the game itself? Peace out.